Diamond Alliance International and the Iraqi Alliance of Disability Organizations conducted mixed methods research to understand risks and experiences of gender-based violence for persons with disabilities and older people in Iraq and the barriers they face in accessing services. In February 2021, a team of data collectors who are persons with disabilities conducted hundreds of interviews, ran focus group discussions, and conducted an online survey. This unique team collaboratively developed accessible research tools, including easy-to-read consent forms and picture supports. They collected data from persons with disabilities, their families, community leaders, and service providers across three cities, Baghdad, Mosul, and Suleiman. In brief, our research found that 61% of persons with disabilities, 59% of men and 63% of women had experienced some form of gender-based violence. Among those that experienced violence, 95% reported that they faced barriers when trying to seek help. The most common barriers were transport difficulties, cost, and inaccessible services, feelings of fear, shame, and worries about their privacy. The aim of this research is to inform strategies to decrease the risk of gender-based violence for persons with disabilities and older people in Iraq and to increase the accessibility of services. To do this, Heartland Alliance International and IATO are sharing our results locally and globally. We want our results to reach other organizations of persons with disabilities, Iraqi government actors and policymakers, and humanitarian and development actors. In addition, we are sharing our methodology to support other researchers to conduct inclusive, participatory studies about and designed by persons with disabilities. You can access more details about our findings underneath this video. This research was generously funded by the ELRA Humanitarian Innovation Fund.